Prince Harry revealed how he felt trapped by his royal life after the loss of his mother and had no one to confide in, according to a royal expert. Royal biographer Angela Levin revealed the revelation in her book, Harry, Conversations with the Prince. The book reveals the real man behind the camera, his childhood, and the impact of losing his mother. Ms. Levin said Harry was falling apart inside but managed to put on a good front to fulfill his royal duties. She said, it wasn't until 2017 that he confessed that the previous few years had been a real struggle, that he'd bottled up his emotions for two decades but waited until he was 28 before seeking help. At the time he'd felt trapped by his royal life and grief-stricken over the loss of his mother. He badly needed someone to talk to about this but it was hard to find anyone emotionally available. Ms. Levin has said how Harry did not seek support from his family members who believed emotions should be kept under control. She continued, it was not a subject he felt able to raise with his father who was very happy with Camilla Parker Bowles and had made a new, more contented life for himself. Harry was pleased for him, but how could he pour out his heart about how much he missed his mother, longed to feel at peace in her arms, when he knew full well how devastated she had been about Camilla's presence. Nor could he open his heart to the Queen and Duke of Edinburgh who had mixed feelings about the charismatic but troubled princess and believed that emotions should be kept under control. While Harry, like his mother, does not. Ms. Levin also said Harry felt aimless once he'd left active duty in the army. Harry thought the army would provide him with a lifelong career. Prince Harry is sixth in line to the throne and married Meghan Markle, the Duchess of Sussex, in 2018. Meghan and Prince Harry's son, Archie Harrison Mountbatten-Windsor, is seventh in line to the British throne.